Hello there, I'm the Rampant Mystic, and welcome back to Slay the Spire, and I believe today we have a defect one to do. Ascension level 20, max level, double bosses, so let us begin. Now again, as per yesterday, today's episodes are going to be slightly shorter. I know that yesterday was supposed to be potentially the last, but I miscalculated because I do have to record these on Tuesday. So, yeah. Anyway. Let's exchange our relic. We got a cursed key. That's amazing. We're not actually going to restart the run. Right, I do see where the super elite is with a triple rest and double shop. And we're going to take only the late shop. We're not going to take the early one. We are not going to get curses this early. Now, of course, the cursed key presents a problem. It always has. Especially if you're going for the heart. Because you need to actually open up a chest. Which means you're guaranteed to get a curse. Hello, we have lethal. Go for the eyes. Always go for the eyes. Now just watch as we pick up uh Nico Eye. Alright, we're gonna triple defend here. Wanted to hit one of them, but whatever. Dual cast should be if I'm lucky in the next hand. It is not. Alright, you're the one that's gonna be hit. We're gonna be defending. Actually, they're both getting hit. Probably should have used Go For The Eyes afterwards, that was going to be a little bit of extra damage. Go For The Eyes and Strike. Hello, Defrag. Uh, I'm going to do this, we're actually going to be going re relatively relicless, and that is not worth it. Give me back my HP. Remove, Upgrade, or Transform. I would honestly rather upgrade here because the likelihood of us actually <laughs> upgrading there is uh, very slim. In fact, I'm gonna go so far as to say it, it's gonna be none. There's no chance we're doing that. No. No. Slimes! Incoming! Uh. Well, that's not enough. I mean, I'm playing everything, but that's still not enough. Yeah, I'm on 20 health now. Oh no. Alright, okay, duplication potion will help. Second go for the eyes, no, but a cold snap wouldn't be bad at all. Alright, we're resting here. Peace pipe is probably not gonna be used. I will prioritize upgrades over peace pipe unless. Okay, that's nice. We got one orb out. As so long as we can get defrag out with two extra strength. That should be fun. Last turn. Last turn. Okay, we got the defrag out. Good. And we even managed to open up a little bit, that's kind of nice. Now I'm gonna dual cast something, as in uh, duplication potion cast something, but what is that something going to be? I think it has to be the zap. And the reason for that is we are actually, I should have dual casted a zap first. Uh, and you know what, do it. Yeah, alright, that's good. Eh, 20 block, nice. Well, we're dealing a decent amount of damage. Currently we have our decks up and we're dealing 15 damage per turn, so I'm kind of happy. As long as we keep defending, I should be fine. That being said, there's one defense and two attack orbs, which will finish the enemy next round. Perfect. They didn't even need to attack. Uh, there's the Emerald Key. There is a Beam Cell, which I'm actually going to pick up. We're going to do a Barrage if we can. A Dual Cast got upgraded. That is perfect and one defend, exactly what we want. So we're going to probably do a mixture of orbs here, if possible. I can upgrade here. 34 HP. We have one, two guaranteed fights, one not guaranteed, and a rest. It's a Hexaghost fight, so I'm actually not going to be resting here. Uh, go for the eyes or beam cell. I think go for the eyes is a little bit more important in my opinion. Most of our damage should be coming from the orbs anyway, for now at least. Here we are going to open it. We're going to get pain. We're not going to get ornamental fan, which is going to take sapphire key, and we're probably not going to open any other chest unless there's a shop directly after it, because cards like normality, as we've seen, can ruin the run very, very badly. The problem is, this is going to do a lot of damage to me. And there's the frailty for two turns. Great! Ah, uh, there's a beam cell at least. Who do I go for the eyes? Ah, uh, the pain! The pain! I had to do all that though. I had to. They left me no choice. And right, we are dual casting here. Alright, well, you know what? 7 HP. It's, it's more than we need. 
<laughs> Hopefully that sounded convincing enough. Ah, this is actually enough damage, okay. Uh, we're almost fully defended. I'm not gonna dual cast it here, not for one HP. We're currently fine. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna be doing uh, this and passing. Actually, that was the same thing. I was gonna take one HP damage there regardless of what happened. Oh well. I want a second cold snap. Alright, there's our shop. Let's remove the pain. I really want to pick that up. But it's not going to happen. Hell well. Can't win them all. Because we're going to be going uh, potentially very heavily uh, on uh, frost orbs. I'm actually going to pick up blizzard here. Hopefully upgraded as well. Hopefully. Uh, maybe not. Judging by this fight, probably not. Electrodynamics here would be nice, but nothing actually defensive here. So yeah, it's going to be... Electrodynamics, and I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna die. There's nothing I can do. There just isn't. <laughs> oh, that's just lucky. Ugh. Just, mm. All right, let's redo. This could have worked, by the way, especially after the Blizzard pickup. That was a little bit of extra AOE there. We had a defrag upgrade. We had a couple of orb generations. Frost Orb Generations, in fact, which is actually really good, especially if you have one or two defrags. It tends to go a little bit more on the insane side. Okay, this is not a path we want to take. Look at this. <laughs> Five fights, Elite, Unknown, Super Elite, Rest, and then just a bunch of fights. Uh, sorry, not happening. Uh, there's no point. I can see my death there, and I'm not going to take the Super Elite on the second or third floor. I'd rather have it on the first than take it on the third, because that's most likely what's going to happen. Now the Super Elite is very far to the left. Again, a single rest with one guaranteed, but not absolutely guaranteed Elite. I could skip it. Mm, a little bit pointless to skip it there. Alright, let's go. Maybe we get something good here. Or maybe we get a force field early, which, sure, sure. I'm gonna try and build powers, but you never know. It's probably not gonna happen. We're just gonna take the 50 gold here. We actually have a decent amount of gold. I'm considering skipping that elite for the shop. On the other hand, we have a cult snake. Yeah, we're gonna go to the shop. I think it's, hello. I mean, it's gonna be good for a reinforced body. Now, if I could pick up Glacier here, and the bomb, I would, but I can only pick up one. Is the bomb more important? Mm, yes. Chemical X is really good for reinforced body, though, but not if I'm running frost orbs. Well, it's still good. It's still really good. Really solid pickup in terms of relics. On the other hand, it's AoE. It's not a lot of AoE, but it is AoE. I'll pick up Glacier, I'll pick up Chemical X, and we'll leave. I'm extremely defensive at the moment, so I'm really hoping to pick up a barrage here. This is going to be useless. <laughs> I don't know why I picked it. Yeah, we might pick up a power or two. It's going to be hell for the Awakened One, but... Ah, well. uh, focus over gamblers any day. Second Glacier. Sure. Sure. At this point, we are extremely defensive. And I don't have a single barrage, I believe. So I'm hoping this one over here complies and gives me a barrage. No, seriously, please. Just, just one barrage. That's all I ask. One. A single one. Or a blizzard. We have double glacier. A blizzard here... I mean, sets us, really. Double glacier plus a single cold snap. We have a relatively thin deck. Yeah, I can see this working. It's not enough to fully defend, but if I keep fully defending, I'm not, not actually doing any damage while I'm doing three. Which is not much. I can single defend here, let's go for the back one, maybe we take it out. Maybe, potentially. And that is so short, unless I invest two attacks, which is actually fine. Huh. Well, I can't really evoke that. I mean, dual cast that. All 
our main source of damage appears to be currently the one zap. Which is not a good thing. No, it's not. I know. Oh, come on. I need some damage because uh, I'm probably not going to go for the extra elite because we have no damage. I'm going to still hope to get a barrage out of one of these. Ah, you know what? That's damage. I'm not going to turn it down. That is damage. All right. That's a straight up boost. All right, sure. We're fully defended here. Actually, overly defended, but that's fine. I'd rather be overly defended than under defended. Any day. There she be. Now we need a capacitor. We can actually go for this one, but just before the super lead, I'm a little bit more skeptical. I'm just, just you know, just a little bit. And I'm doing this. I'm, I was, I'm, I'm still hoping actually. Now was. I'm still hoping that. Nope. Never mind. My hopes and dreams have uh, flown away. Like the birds I used to have once upon a time. Anyway. Uh, we are actually not cold snap. I knew it was going to hit. I just knew it. I just knew that it was going to hit the one with the block. It always does. Uh, do I need to dual cast any? Nope. Ha. Ah. Oh, that's fine. I forgot. I didn't actually trigger the curl up on that one. Hello, Defrag. Sure. Didn't even see the rest of the cards. I think there was a fusion in there. Uh, okay. I do not want any of these. Thank you. I could take that. Oh, no. I'm running Frost Orbs. What am I doing? Why did I take Blast? Whatever. I could take Loop, though. I don't want the Zap. Oh, well. That's fine. It, it's still usable, especially on this fight. But I would still rather play, play the defrag. Now, I'm going to play the focus potion here because the guardian isn't going to be much of an issue. Especially if I can somehow get a capacitor. Now, we don't need to play any other cards. I just need to play barrage at this point because that's 10 block per turn. Hey, well, there's no point in enraging it. Not when you're vulnerable. Ah, uh, probably should have used this, actually. Oops, that, that was a little bit my fault. Now, this is a power, not a skill, and we are going to use it. And then we're going to dual cast for a 30, and we are going to have lethal. Good, good. So I used the weakness potion. I clicked twice by accident there. That was not even my mouse. I can't blame it on my mouse even there. That was, uh, that was my fault. <laughs> I clicked twice. Uh, oops. What did I bottle? Oh, boy, a strike. <laughs> Which one? At least I should upgrade that one. You know, I could have bottled the defrag. That would have been good. Play it turn one? Yeah, absolutely. No, no. We don't do that here. We just don't. We bottle strikes here. Uh, oh, well, that's fine. Uh, that's our first power. So this thing's going to be three costs. Still not useful. But it'll probably be, end up being removed. Eventually. Barrage is going to be the next upgrade, and we're probably not resting just before the boss fight. We should be fine. I was hoping to be able to save the Focus Potion. Actually, I'm saying we should be fine, but I don't know. Are we? Yes, we are. Good. As long as I can upgrade the defrag, we'll be golden against the boss fight. And dead. Oh no. Oh no, I want it. I really do. I really do. I think this, if, if it's ever going to happen, it's going to be now. And it has to be now. Some might say Barrage is the better upgrade here, and indeed it is, but I'm just going to use that. And the Focus Potion will allow me to defend myself for a lot longer. Sorry, the Focus Potion, the Defrag. Alright, that's not what I wanted to do. Blah, uh, hello 36. Ha. Huh. Well, I, uh, well, this will save me, but it'll save me for the next four turns. This fight is going to take longer than four turns. Trust me, it's going to take longer than four turns. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yes, I did do the math, but... It was just a tough call whether I want to do this fight on 1 HP or in 4 turns. And, uh... 
Uh, I decide on the one HP, I guess. Okay. Well, we're fully defended here. That doesn't mean I shouldn't use the Chaos Orb. On the other hand, though, I don't know what's coming up next turn. A single defend. <laughs> uh, almost, almost. Right, I can actually fully defend here. That's fine. That's 20, right? Uh, that's... That's 12, right? Oh my god, I've been doing the math for the last couple of rounds and now, now I'm like fizzled out. That That's that's my maximum, like, one minute of math. And that's it, and that's per day, that's not per hour, that's per day. Uh, so yeah, we should not be fine here, actually. Oh, we actually, we are. Never mind. I have a defense. I was like, should I play Glacier or not? No. You don't need to play Glacier. Uh, at this point, I'm a little bit more on the fearful side, so I kind of don't want to play the Zap. I know it's very helpful, but 1 HP, come on. Nope. How good are we here? Not very. It's better now, but I really wanted to attack. But I'm willing to use one. Okay, that's exactly what I was hoping for. Now, if I can defend just, just long enough for that to get into front. That's all I need. In fact, we are fully defended here. Indeed we are. In fact... Yeah, that's the perfect turn because that's going to be our killer. Ah. Is it? I need to wait, but if I wait... I have a couple of more turns. No, I can't wait. That's too much. That's 50 damage. Do it. We're doing it now. We're placing the zap and we're going to try and get rid of this thing as quickly as possible. I need to evoke the orb, don't I? No, no I don't. No I don't. I don't want to play Chaos yet. Again, trying to be as defensive as I possibly can. Uh, that being said, I do want that orb in front. It's not gonna happen. There's no need. Okay, well... Well, we did it. So... Nice! Nice, that's what I'm gonna say. I'm actually going to pick up Creative AI here as a second power. I know machine learning was there. Absolutely willing to take this. Absolutely. 100%. Now give me capacitors. I know I didn't pick up extra energy, but with the frost orbs there, with the defrag. Well, with the glaciers, there is a likelihood. Now I want to pick up the path with the most rest because this is generally where I like to take the red key on the second floor, but there aren't that many rests. Two is the most I can see, so I can choose single or double elite. Guess which one I'm choosing. In fact, if there was with no elite, I'd probably choose that just for, just so I can get the red key guaranteed here. But I can't. So we're gonna go here and we're gonna choose one elite. Oh, where's that melter? Where is it? I want it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh no. Well, uh, this fight won't actually be very long. And the reason for that is Melter is about to show up. There it is. You see, I knew it was going to show up. I've always known it was going to show up. Alright, Fire Potion is good. We have a Regen Potion as well. Double Energy might not be bad. Again, preferably pre-upgraded, but... Uh, no, no. We can't take it. I can't... I, I don't have the luxury of upgrading it, which is kind of the issue. Wish I could use both of these. Plus the Glacier. Oh well. That extra energy. That extra energy. Actually, this was probably the perfect place to use this regen potion on. And... Alright. A little bit better. Since this is generally a prolonged fight, even if you have a Melter. Defrag into Chaos? I am frail for one more round. Ah, well there's the extra energy I wanted. I want a capacitor. Please drop a capacitor. I would be very grateful. One could say I would be indebted to you. Now, I'm fully defended, so I don't care about playing anything else, including evoking that orb. Doesn't need to. Uh, I could evoke it now. Probably will, actually. What's the point, though? I mean, I won't even do any damage. So. Now there is a little bit more of a point. 
because I can play my defense. Yeah, it's one less hit, but I needed to. I technically could have played it slightly later. Oh well. I need 12, I have 12. Uh, yep, play that, sure. That's a frost orb. Come on. Come on, that melter. Come on. Alright, we're not fully defended here, so I will use one block. Ah, uh, we had lethal, I'm an idea. I forgot I had a lightning orb. Even though I was just looking at that. A second barrage would be useful. Preferably pre-upgraded skim. Do I need that? Yeah, yeah, it's usable. Um, preferably though, we do have a shop here. Okay. I need to upgrade barrage, and I'm on I'm on relatively high health. I guess it could have been worse. Right, we're starting off with 12 block and frailty, of course, as per usual. Oh, come on. I was about to use Belter, but after that Plasma Orb, I mean, it's useful, but I really wanted a Darkness Orb here. Evoking the Plasma Orb is a little bit pointless. See, it's going to be four extra block, which I guess might be useful. Eh, yeah, sure do it. It's the best defense we're going to have for a very long time. This is actually very usable here. Yep, do it. Well, there's a storm, if I've ever seen one. You know what? We are actually going to play it. I am fully defended, so let's actually keep continuing with the attacks. Now, I'm hoping for a couple of defrags or a static discharge. Ah, uh, that's fine. We're going to play the zap and we're going to play melter. I have two lightning orbs now. Come on. Come on. Ah, hello world, of course. Uh, at this point, absolutely going to be playing this. Maybe should have dual casted that orb first. Oh. Ah, chaos barrage, defend. Oh, we are with. <sighs> okay, this is gonna be played. Please, thank you. It's exactly what I wanted to happen. It was a hail mary. It was either that or a three block. I was not going for the three block. All right, this is perfect. We have lethal here. Uh, actually, that was my mouse. I was about to consider attacking the Mystic because there was no point in attacking the Centurion, but uh, my must sort of let go. That's fine. It's it's not going to cause us any issues at all, so. Uh, Leap, we are running Frost Orb, so Leap is not recommended. Beam Cell is, on the other hand. We are running a lot of aggressive attacks. Aggressive attacks. I don't know of any passive attacks. Well, I wanted to pick up the key here as well, but that key can wait a while longer because you're guaranteed at least one thing. One thing. Actually, I should have done this. I could have gotten Melter. I did not. You know what? I'm just gonna get rid of it. Just so I don't have any daisies in my deck. You, my friend, have made the biggest mistake you ever will. You have fought me. And I have Melter in the deck. Oh, and it's the very last card in the deck, really. Uh, I'm not gonna do... Yeah, I will. I don't want to take the damage. And plus... Oh, right, I keep forgetting. We do get one or back. Haha. -ha. Too bad I'm gonna be one short, but... Haha. -ha. Ah. I think it had the last laugh. Uh, okay, never mind. There's a duplication potion and a loop. Do I want a loop? I probably, but I have creative AI, so we're going to base everything around that. I'm going to rest here. I wasn't going to, but I, I don't know. I don't know what. Yeah, we have no AOE, so. Oh boy. <laughs> you know what? It's a Hail Mary. It's a double Hail Mary, hopefully. We weren't going to get much block out of this anyway, so. Oh boy. Glacier, and I was really hoping to be able to play it, but I couldn't. Good news is I blocked most of the damage this round. Double defrag, absolutely. Actually, triple defrag. Yep, yep. Sign, sign me up. And a defend. All right. It is looking a lot better now. A 53 block per turn. We did not play blast condition, right? No, we just played defrags. Okay. Uh, I don't actually have the energy to play anything else. 
So what we're going to do is we're actually going to play Chaos Orb, get a Frost Orb, and evoke even more Frost Orbs. Keep evoking those orbs. Eventually I'll uh, kill them. I just... it's, it's going to take a while. We even took damage there. There's Electro. Can't play the buffer, but can remove all of them. Uh, that is not enough. Okay, that's better. Ceramic Fish and a Blizzard. Okay, there's most of our AoE. Well, all of our AoE. Random shop with Regal Pillow? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. I mean, well, it's not a random shop. It was a guaranteed shop, but it has Regal Pillow. What do I need? Do I need anything to risk getting Ori? Well, to risk getting Ori. We are... Actually, you know what? I'm going to go for this shop as well. So I'm going to save my money. I could pick up a Smoke Bomb. Uh, liquid Bronze would be nice. If I do get a Liquid Bronze, I will be saving it for the hard fight if we get to it. Okay, I don't need Darkstorm Perhaps, so we got that key as well. Lovely. Now I just need the red key, which is objectively probably one of the harder ones. At least for me. It's kind of a... It's kind of been annoying, really. Because I can't upgrade. Most of the time I love upgrading, so... Ah, oh, too bad I can't use that. Now, this fight... Should be over relatively soon, and I really don't want to take too much damage, so I will be using that. Well, relatively soon. I hope it's over relatively soon. Uh, I really do. Because this fight can be horrible. It actually is. I'm vulnerable, right. This guy makes you vulnerable, I forgot. Oh no. Oh no. No, 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 me no like. No, 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 no. No. And my frost orbs are... Slowly crumbling apart. Ah, uh, you are gone. I'm just gonna get rid of you. Alright, we should be fine here on defense. Now I just need to muster up some sort of damage. Oh boy. We're dead. I have one more round. No, I'm just dead. This is where I die. Alright, managed to fully defend. I am very much surprised at myself. I shouldn't have used that. That was stupid. I had no energy to play anything else. There's a Melter. Actually, no. Maybe it was a bright idea. Maybe I tried to get the Dazes out of the deck. Yeah, that's what I tried to do. Oh boy. How much damage is this? 18? Yeah, not enough. Evoking these orbs is not enough as well. I need 30 block. I am not going to get that. Oh well, it was nice knowing you while it lasted. Anyway, we're going to end things off here. As I mentioned, hopefully today is going to be the last day in which things are going to be a little bit shorter. We shall know tomorrow, though. For now... I've been the Rampant Mystic. I do hope you enjoyed this episode of Slay the Spire, and I do hope to see you all in the next one.